स्पिरिचुअल मास्टर ओम विष्णु पाल श्रीमद भक्ति प्रज्ञान के सेम टू माई शिक्षा गुरु नित्य लीला प्रविष्ट ओम विष्णु पाल श्रीमद भक्ति डिस्कशिंग अबाउट भजन रहस्य We are coming to fifth. That is Krishna Shakti, attachment to Krishna. We are finished. And what is to learn? First, from Nishtha, Ruchi will come. Taste will come. In what subject taste will come? Weight will come. In sadhan. And this taste is divided into two. Vastu vaisist apekshini, vastu vaisist anapekshini. The meaning is that after passing this stage of so many anats in you, anats are there, but not like nama aparat. They are in very minute form, like. When anyone will sing like them with guitar, with harmonium, with so many instruments, with very sweet melody, then it will be very tasteful. But any man, high class of the book, with beating, melting heart, if he is singing. But no instrument, and his voice, voice is some part not uh, so sweet. Then that person will not have taste to him. If anywhere deities are so much well dressed, then he will have to. He will have taste in darshan, and the same deity, not well dressed, no taste. In his own temple, his own temple, everywhere, whether bhakti is there or not, they are very well dressed deities. And at a time, a three persons blowing on. I mean, very beautiful way. Oh, they are with the art and the performer, and with a oh, a tune, what? Melody, what's the kirtan? Ah, huh. ah. So many persons, so many sannyasis are with a gun. Looking very fine. Or oh, anyone come and he will have some. Just to say, oh, oh, very nice. Again and again. So this is this. When well decorated, this is well tuned and everything. Then, so his all things. All the practices of bhakti, 
he has taste. But when? Well decorated. Otherwise, no. If he will go to take darshan of Vansidas Babaji and his deities, he will return back or nothing is there. But his mood is so high that he quarrels with his deity. Hmm? Oh, this Vita is very simple, but this is very naughty. Hmm? He told me to bring flowers and went to the tree and was climbing and he sent another one, oh boy, and pushed me and my leg is now. I will not tell him to worship. Oh, go to another person. <laughs> what is it? What is it? And weeping and quarreling so much. So, we cannot be like that. So, if taste is coming, but it depends on something, melody or good, decoration or anything. And another is of what? Not like this. Whether he is dressed or not, any heard from very far away, Hare Krishna and he became friendly. Oh, what? Where? From where it is coming? Like Radhika. Radhika is so superior. But example and he heard from very far away Krishna, anyone was telling and he became So do those classes of Krishna. And if he will continue, <coughs> then he is lost. That is Or oh, this will be changed into Ashakti. What is Ashakti? Pale Aigi Anapekshin. And Uske Bad Anapekshin. Pale Apekshin is Ashakti. अभी उसको ऐसा ही होगा उसका जो निष्ठा है लौकिक निष्ठा है पर जो जिसको एक साधारण आदमी है और इसकी निष्ठा अब हो चुकी है इसलिए इसका इसकी जो सौण में जो टेस्ट होगा ये उससे कुछ अलग है ये भी साधन का जन्म है वह अनर्थ यही अनर्थ है यही अनर्थ है Hmm. Yes, hotel. Hmm. The question comes about hearing these two stages of Ruchi. Oh, where is my? We just heard the two stages or two classifications of Ruchi, taste. One stage in which the sadhak is actually impelled from within for hearing chanting or darshans or any limb to perform any limb of bhakti because of any external cause. For example, in Kirtan we hear very nice music and very sweet throat voice and all those things. And in the next stage, successive stage, the sadhak is now so strong that he doesn't get at all affected by any external uh, attractive or non-attractive uh, circumstances, but he is uh, flawlessly, his heart, his tendency is running towards performing these activities. So I asked the question to the Gurudev that just for example we heard that how nicely in this contemple the RP is being performed. So any person who has no connection with bhakti whatsoever, any ordinary person comes and he gets very attracted to see that very nice RP going on. So what is the difference between this person's face and a person who has gone through all the stages of this anartha nivritti and is now 
reaching towards the end of Nishtha. Why he has to now still be uh, waiting or dependent on external attractions to develop his Shraddha or Ruchi for name or Harikatha or for the deities? My question is clear? Yes. So Srila Gurudev is telling that this first, first stage of Ruchi itself in which the sadhak is depending on these external attractions, it itself signifies or denotes that there are still some anarthas left. Still something is left and when he will continue performing these activities in sadhu sang, he will now come to the matured stage of Ruchi, which will no more depend on these external things. Our main thing is that to whom he told that they came of oh, general persons. They are no, he has no question of general persons because they, they are, this test is only oh, worldly. Look, and he is not worldly. He is somewhat transcendental. Oh, Nishtha has come, he has passed another and also Nishtha has come and after that he and, and they are, oh they will go at one time, quickly they fall. This is what he So I am telling all these things. That if you want to develop your Krishna consciousness, you will have to pass through the process. And you should judge yourself where you are. In how much water? You are the water in you are standing where? Huh? Oh, how little water. Huh? Little water. <laughs> I know. Among you, <coughs> if to anyone, if I am not giving honor properly, not talking with him. Oh, good. I will not come here. Oh, he is not giving attention to me. I know so many. They left our classes. But those who have passed through the proper channel, Anath has gone somewhat and after Nishtha which is coming, oh, he will have some taste. If we will rebuke him, even he will come. So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, first he told, in what process, process we should chant name, that frame will come. And for this he quoted one verse of Chaitanya Chaitanya, Tuna the peace to me. And here, something more. <coughs> if he has taste, then Osadha will think like this. Ainanda Sanja King Karam Patitang Me Vishama Visham Pamam Buddha Kripyato Pad Pankaj Sthiti Shuddhisham Vishama What is the meaning? <laughs> this fifth, fifth shloka of Sri Shashastakam Aye nanda tanu jakin karam patitam mam di shame babam budo kripayatava parapam kaja stika duli sarisham chintayam. O son of Maharaj Nanda, I am your eternal servant, but somehow or other I have fallen into this very deep ocean of material existence. So, O son of Mah Maharaj Nanda, please be merciful unto me, pick me up and place me as an ins insignificant tiny particle of dust in the dust of the lotus feet. Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Shri Bhakti Vinod Thakur, he used to do like this, but in night, checking his mother and weeping, he used to chant this, the shlok, with piercing his heart in, in eyes and melting. Aishnanda Tanja Tinkaram Patitam Me Vishama Bhavam Bhavam 
कृपया तव पाद पंकज I'm very unhappy. Please take me out of that, and you should engage me in your service. I'm your Krishna. I'm your eternal servant. But you have purchased me. You have claimed to do this. You have the right. So I'm your so such kind of. तब दास तब नित्य दास मोई तुम्हारा पास कर दिया है पढ़ी आचु भाव ना वही महादुष्ट बदले कृपा करी मोरे पद पुरी सम तुम्हार सेवक करो यस चलो भक्ति में उठा तू इस टेली और माय सेल्फ हैज एक्सप्लेन्ड इट पहले के साधक क्रॉस दी Process the stage of ruchi uh, and interest in our shakti <coughs> in that avastha. Oh, he becomes so humble and automatically would be as coming in all right. Main and galadash sudha. Badanam kada kada rupya like this. He repents and so na bhakti. I have no taste in your men's and your own. So he, the bhakti is not thought. It's just to weep like this. Then <coughs> at that time when our shakti is somewhat mature, oh, he can realize his Shiddha de, eternal. You should know that we have this material form, very beautiful eyes, curved hair, oh this, it's beautiful, body very strong, beautiful. And in the same way, our transcendental what Swarup. Form. There is a form, very beautiful, and it is Shatashvaru, Shakchidananda Maya. But it is like Krishna. Krishna is Shakchidananda. He has form beautiful, not but not worldly form. How any worldly person see him? How see? Because at that time, Yoga Maya. Has some no no connection like from powerhouse. So we are having like. But if connection is cut off, then if you will do similar. Krishna is Sachidananda Ghana. His form is also Sachidanam. His all qualities are like that. Don't say that. Ata Krishna Madhi na pavet drayamindriyaiha shivan mukhohi jivado. When what we are chanting, this is not pure name. When oh, with godless mercy, the name Prabhu will come and dance. Oh, then this is true. What we are doing? Vibration of vibration of air. Only vibration coming from throat and from tongue. Material, material words, effort by our senses. But when 
relapsing our this condition and prayer, O oh, Nam Prabhu will come. At some time he will dance in your time. And then it is pure name. If pure name comes at once, more than asakti automatic will come. It will come only in this stage of our life. So try to chant your name like this. Always, without interruption. And then sing your parishram in the world. And Krishna will come in this form of name and he will turn on. At that time, no laziness, no sleepness, nothing. He will always be very happy all so that is true. We should try to do like that, that Krishna name should come and down found tongue. Krishna past time should come and it should reveal in our heart that on and on, so happy, so happy. You cannot realize now of when it will come and then you can see. It cannot be told by words. Cannot be. So try to chant always, 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 and when it will come. Oh, you are alive. Oh, this is constant. It will come from your heart, taking what? Your heart. Huh? And in the form of tears. That tears are also constant. Because we related to pure. And then, worldly, everything will be false. At that time you will not remember the worldly relation, worldly sense, gratification, nothing, beauty and everything. So, but you know, how to you to do that. And he has given a line. So we should try to follow. <coughs> At that time Krishna may hear his, his prayers, otherwise not. Saranga Saranagati, Taha Prathna Sune, otherwise he will not. If you have strong Saranagati, and in Saranagati, oh, Krishna is very powerful. He is always serving me, protecting me, nourishing me. He will, he must support and nourish. If his faith is there, then, oh, he will hear. Otherwise, no. In this world, there are so many lakhs and lakhs, thousands and thousands of persons who are, almost all are unhappy. <coughs> the weak bitterly, but Krishna never hears. Oh God, oh my God, but he will not. Because he is not surrendered. So you must be surrendered. And then Krishna will hear. <coughs> At that time, if Anatha is there and you are not surrendered, he will hear and neglect. Why? If you are chanting name and thinking what to do, nowadays all businesses are in town. Now my business is to be a stock life. No so much income. What to do? What to do? It may be that your business may be okay. No effect, because Krishna will not hear, he will neglect you. He knows that this is like a poison, and he wants poison. How, why I should give poison? He will not hear. But when he will know that he knows all these things like poison, and wants my, me to serve, and then he will do it. First, in first stage he acts like antaryami. 
Anta Jami, you know? Super soul likes Sakshi. He will neglect. Like judges. They hear both parties. And he is neutral. Hmm? He is neutral. But he, if he will see that he is right, all right, and he is waiting for right thing. And he has come for good decision, hmm? that then he can be a good favorable to him. So Krishna at first in our heart he is like Sakshi. And when he will surrender himself, then he will not be like a witness. What he will be? Oh, he will hear and do a call. What I told you should repeat. If Krishna hears our prayer, that we want something material, we don't actually sincerely want his service. He sees that we want something that will be hurting to ourselves. So he will hear the prayer but neglect to fulfill our desires because he doesn't want to hurt us. If he sees that we he sincerely... He will be engaged in... Or he won't hear at all. But if, he, if we sincerely want his service, then he'll pay attention if we're Sharanagat, if we take everything favorable for his service, reject everything unfavorable, are very meek and humble, are fully surrendered, and see him as our only maintainer and protector, then he will hear and he will also fulfill that desire. Hmm. You can hear one example. Uh, in the assembly of Kaurav, Kaurav, you know, Dujodhan, Dushasan, Karna, Shakuni, and all. Uh, they were, Dujodhan and his party was going to insult Pandava. By trick, they defeated Pandavas in gambling. And they, but they controlled them to give Draupadi. Huh? Also in gambling. And then Durjadhan told to Dushasan, I want that you should take her clothes, garment, and she should be naked. And in naked she should sit here. I want. You should do at home. Like demon he began to do. He was how much strong? Like thousand And he began to. At that time Drakti, what to do? And he began to start towards five Pandavas that they will help him. But they were coming to help, but Yudhisthi Maharaj is stopping. Oh, let's see what further will come. He has full belief in Krishna. He must come. So we should not do. And after that, after that, <coughs> Durjodhan was began to pull. He looked upon Vishan Pitama, Donachar, Pitachar, so many that they will save me. But they did like they could not save her. <coughs> then she began to pray to Krishna, oh Krishna. But he still the bell was in his teeth. And Krishna in Dwarka, surrounded by twins, he was in hurry. And they asked, why you are in hurry? Anyone is calling me. 
But why you don't go? Because not full surrender. And after that, Prabhupada gave up. Sorry, from his teeth. And with four, two hands up, Oh, Gebanda Raku Sarana Abhutu. And for, totally surrendered to And he closed her, she closed her eyes. What will be happen if she happen? Like, oh, Krishna, at once, run, run away. He forget to take shoes, even, and run away. Quickly, in a second, he came, and he became garment or cloth of Draupadi. And then, do sarsana. Pulling, 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 pulling. He became toy. So, if you are not surrendered like or full handed like this, fully surrendered, he will not hear. Krishna is very crooked, you know. But when he will come in heart, oh, you cannot get him out. <laughs> never and never. So you should try to full surrender. Then Krishna may come. Otherwise chanting name you will not do. You are chanting worldly, uh, remembering worldly things. Oh, my husband has left. My wife has left me. What to do? What to do? And chanting. Krishna will let Then he is telling, Oh, getting up on earth, having relation with Krishna. One, if you have very beautiful form, all the modes, then we have some special relation with Krishna. These relations are divided into five. Shanta, Dasya, Sakha, Vasal and Vadu. Among these five relations, oh, top most is Madhu and beloved of Krishna. Krishna is my beloved. Only Krishna is my beloved. I am beloved of Krishna. So these kinds of will come at that time. So Srinivatan. Srimad Bhagavatam is telling, Sukadeva Goswami is telling to Srila Parikshit Maharaj. Srinivatam Sokatha Krishna Punya Savana Kirtana Hridyam Tasto Yabhadrani Budhine Suhit Sada Nasta Prayesu Abhaddesu Nityam Bhagavat Sevaya Bhagavat Uttam Shlev Bhakti Bhakti Nesha Tadarajastamu bhava kamulu bhavyascha je. Eta etai anabhidham sthitam satte prasinte. Any kirtan should be done. You have a strong belief on this Srinath Bhagavatam point. So, that Sri Krishna, the personality of Godhead, who is Paramatma's super soul in everyone's heart, and the benefactor of the truthful devotee, that he cleanses desire for material enjoyment from whom that punya shravana kirtana that that devotee who has been doing proper hearing and chanting hmm, he cleanses his eye from material enjoyment from the heart of such devotee and within him he has the such devotee has developed the urge to hear his messages 
So, Srila Vishnu Chakrabartitakur, he explains how Krishna, he comes and he cleanses desire. That one who is hearing, meritorious hearing, what does that mean? That first he must be hearing from the proper source. He must be hearing from one who is realized so. Yao Bhagavad Vaishnavarastane, Ikanta Shokurum Chitani Charani. That one should go at the lotus feet of Maha Bhagavad devotee. Surrendering and hearing from such a personality. Then he will show one how to take shelter, how to do Ekantiki Bhakti and ultimately take shelter at the lotus feet of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So such very advanced realized soul that within his heart Krishna is there. Krishna se Toma, Krishna dite pa. Toma sakatiache amito kangala. Krishna Krishna boli. Daitava pache pache. That Krishna is within his heart. And when he's speaking Harikata, then Krishna, who is situated within his heart, manifests in the form of sound, Shabda Brahma. And he enters into the heart of that devotee who has been hearing very, very attentively with the mood of surrender that Srila Gurudev has been explaining. Because the devotee has opened his heart to hear Harikata, then Krishna entering and saying that, oh, that this is my family member. He's taking shelter of my family member. Then he comes with his own broom. And Krishna, he enters into that, into the room, into that heart. And then he starts to clean. Only by this process of meritorious hearing. Srinvatam Swakata Krishna Punya Shravna Kirtana. By this process of hearing, then Krishna himself, in the form of transcendental sound, he comes and he does everything. This is the process. Keep your hands here. And then, and then you have to decide whether we are following that process or not. Hmm? Whether I am following. Then your heart will answer, no, we are not following. Exactly. So try to do like this. Before following that process, I have come by, inspired by our Guru Bhargava, to inspire you for this process. If you will adopt the process, at once you will be very happy. And fear will come like this. Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rata, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. 